Oklahoma State quarterback Spencer Sanders. He's been dealing with a shoulder injury. Head coach Mike Gundy was tight-lipped on his status, telling reporters earlier this week, quote, y'all don't ask me about injuries, and we won't have any problems. Okay, coach. <laughs> okay. Starting that to sounds like a man that has something to hide. Don't ask no questions. <laughs> I tell no <laughs> lies. <laughs> if Sanders doesn't play, Gunner Gundy, I don't know if that name sounds familiar to y'all, but uh -huh. Gunner Gundy is the backup there, so maybe he'll see some action in the game. What chance does Oklahoma State have if Sanders is banged up in this one, Des? Um, slim and none. I, <laughs> I don't see them beating Texas without Spencer Sanders. Uh, a year ago, Spencer Sanders was a turnover machine. Like, he just couldn't get it right. This year, he's been able to protect the ball. He's making great plays. And I've talked to other defensive coaches who had to prepare for Oklahoma State. And the one thing they talk about when they mention Spencer Sanders is his maturity, his command of the offense. He seems very calm very poised in the pocket and he's not making the mistakes that he made a year ago I think that's something that the offense relies upon not just his his running ability and his passing ability but his leadership so without Spencer Sanders leadership there's no way they beat Texas no yeah way. I, don't, I don't see it either and especially because a year ago he could have rode with his defense yeah this year isn't the same defense. It's no. not what they had. So I, right. I think that they're going to need Spencer. Just his, his dual threat ability alone is what makes that offense go. So yeah. I, I think it's a tough task anyways. I think Texas is playing really, really well. Oh, yeah. But uh, without Spencer, man, I, I, don't, I wouldn't want to call play. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.